representing children who are victims of motor vehicle accidents. Good morning, I'm attorney Neil Burns. And I'm going to talk a little bit today about representing children who are victims of motor vehicle accidents, families of children. I've been doing this for over 35 years and very successfully because we take the time to get to know the family, to get to know the child, and to get to know the case. There's three real parts to this case, in every case. The first is proving liability, proving responsibility. The second is the injury, the damages, and the third is going through the process that insurance companies require, that courts require, to get you the result you need. In this case, this is a little boy, he was five years old. He was at a store in New Hampshire with his sister and his aunt, and they came out, they went back in, they came out again, just the two kids, and they were running across the parking lot in a pickup truck driven by a Massachusetts driver came along too fast and ran over the little boy. There's three parts of this case, as I said. First, we've got to prove responsibility. The gentleman who ran over our client was not drinking. He was cooperative with the police. He felt terrible, of course. And the insurance company said, hey, we're not going to pay because this kid ran out. But we proved through two witnesses that he was driving too fast, that he'd come off the road too fast and that he didn't have time to look to see if people were coming out of the store. The picture of the store right here that we took and we went up there to look at it. Second, what was the condition of this person? We hired a nurse to show that this gentleman had massive dosages of medication, prescribed medication, that were overprescribed. He was essentially over-medicated and we were going to use that at the time of trial. Our client's injuries were not really in question. He was seriously injured. He spent a month in the hospital. There was $100,000 of insurance uh, payments because of his hospitalization, which was necessitated a lien. And so that part was clear. However, we hired an, a, a doctor to look over the medicals and write a report. Some of the permanent injuries were to his liver. And I hired a liver transplant surgeon to review the medicals and to write about the permanent damage to the liver. Because even though the liver was fine when he left, it had some permanent damage to it and we had to present that to the insurance company. And the third part of this case, in every case, was that we had to go through a process. We had to show the insurance company that we were ready, willing, and able to prove the first part of the case, responsibility, the second part of the case, serious long-term permanent injuries, and finally, what those damages were. We had to be able to present those to them. Once we were able to do that, we were able to settle the case very advantageously for our client. If you or someone in your family has been injured, if there's a child in your family that's been injured, give us a call. I have children, I have grandchildren, I have many years of experience working with children and resolving their cases. My partner, Rashawn Jan, has three children as well. We want to work with you. It's a free initial consultation. Please give us a call. Thank you.